The Stanley Family. Wrapping up day number one here of the 2023 Okie Homestead Expo um, here in Pryor, Oklahoma. We've had a really fun field day with lots of learning, and uh, we sat through several good seminars today. First seminar today with Making Money from Your Homestead by VW Family Farms They're there in Central Arkansas. Um, then we went to Intro to Backyard Chickens by the Walker Farm Fam. That was really informative. There we go. Uh, let's see. Then we went over and we sat through off career with Doug and Stacy. Listened to Doug and Stacy talk about building a homestead on a budget. That was a really, really good one. Um, just talk about budgeting things. He's very entertaining. Yes, very entertaining. Um, Let's see, then we set through gardening with Leon. Um, he had one on uh, growing the biggest tomato. That was interesting about whether you're growing a big one to eat or a big one to compete with your neighbors. So it was really fun. Um, the kids love getting to meet several of the YouTubers that they get to watch and uh, play with their kids, visit with several other channels um, just at their booths. And, Talk about different things with them. It was pretty fun, especially to watch the kids because we've gotten to where our TV pretty much consists of YouTube and the kids have a list of um, YouTubers that they know that they're allowed to watch. Most of them were that the Oki Homestead, most of the ones that they watch on the regular. And I got tickled watching them because it was like our version of Disneyland. <laughs> they had to meet these people that they watch all the time and they look up to. And like Michael told several of them and thanked them for their channels because it's really good, clean, filled with information, educational material for our kids and we can turn it on and leave the room and know that they're not gonna see anything they should because it's just good wholesome stuff. But if we look tired, it's because we are. <laughs> it, it, was, it was fun but exhausting. And um, it goes on till tomorrow, so we'll be out doing it all again tomorrow with different classes this time. We had t-shirts made for the event. Uh, we all got matching t-shirts, Stanley family, got lots of funny comments about that. Made it easy to keep an eye on the kids too because we we're all wearing the same color. But, anyway. That's all I got. We'll do a recap of today. You'll see all the videos and pictures we took and then uh, tomorrow we'll take some more and show those. So you guys can do it all. <laughs> so Daniel's gonna be running the show. You have to find those people that are wanting to support you. So just go into it knowing that. Don't sell yourself short. Don't grow your product or whatever, and then price it at Walmart or Kroger.
Stacy was still gonna work and I was gonna maintain the homestead, right? So we were gonna do it off one income from two incomes, two pretty good incomes down to one okay income, right? And then, so I think. That is the what you need to put on the blooms and to finish the tomato to mature. part of today? Was it that chocolate pie you had? Yes, you see some goats? Chickens? Miss Scabby had goats. <laughs> Those weren't Miss Gabby's goats, though. Did you get to play in the corn pit? Is that fun? Maggie, what was your favorite part of today? Playing with those boys with ducks. The ducks. So that was your favorite part, making new friends and playing with them? My second one is playing in the corn. Playing in the corn? That's a nice hat you got there. Where'd you get that? Grocery store. Good evening, Travis. What was your favorite part of the day? Uh, playing with Ransom. Playing with Ransom? Who else did you meet? Jack from Grow Jack Doors. That was pretty cool, huh? Looking forward to his session tomorrow? Yes, sir. Did you like pulling the calf? Yes, Did you learn anything? What's the first thing you've got to feel forward? The head. <laughs> How many feet are you going to feel? Two. What happens if you feel one? Oh, you need to find the other. Evening, Angela. You have a fun day here at the expo today? Yes, sir. Tell us something about what your favorite things were today. Meeting Mazzy from Walker Farm Fam. Meeting Mazzy from Walker Farm Fam? Yes, sir. That's pretty cool. Who gave you all some candy first thing this morning? Ranger. 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 Tell us about some other things you got to experience today. Yeah. Did you get to be the goat? Yes, sir. Is that cool? Yes, sir. And then got to help Chaz pull that thick calf out. Um, I got to see a hive of bees, and I got to see the queen of it. Michael's happy to be in Oklahoma. God's country. Michael has roots here in Oklahoma. It's where his family originates from, so this is like coming home for him. Bring your soon. We do have a YouTube channel, just put in Outdoor Solutions, you'll find us there. Uh, and then we also have a, uh, a website from Field to Table. So this would be basically a full boneless pork loin. As a matter of fact, it's going to be a little bigger because I'm going all the way up to the neck. I sink it down right here, and then I set it down in here. And our next step would be setting it so that we can all come up here. And some people can do this with their, their hands, but I'm not quite big enough. I'll have to do it with my feet. Yeah. Lift this jaw up so you don't get your fingers in here. And you'll hear a click when it's... You hear that? So, it's ready to fire now. So, try to not get my hand in it. So, right now if you're out in the field, you get your steak. 
hammered in, but we don't have that, so we're gonna lower our chain down in here. Now push our dirt in there, and you want it to pack really solid. Now if I tie up the steps right here, you see how it's moving over there? So you don't want that, so you still need to build new Um So a lot of a lot of times they will super up a, a, a uh, horizontal height so that they don't have to destroy the home that's in the place and we started right there. We basically converted a dairy farm barn area into a bison facility. Volunteer. We had over 70 people volunteer. Cannot do it without uh, volunteers. 